At the height of his popularity, Raymond Burr was arguably the sort of attorney everyone wanted. <laughs> As Perry Mason, viewers were glued to their black and white screens for nine seasons, and later he reprised that famous role in 26 Perry Mason made-for-television movies that ran from 1985 to 1993. His respected and amazing talent brought him another TV hit with Ironsides, um, which ran for eight seasons on NBC from 1967 to 1975. He was a star first class of theater, movies, radio, television, he did it all. Other famous roles that he had, and there were many, this is just a smattering, were in Alfred Hitchcock's 1954 thriller Rear Window, where he played the suspected villain in that movie. And then there was the 1956 sci-fi classic Godzilla, and in 1985 he reprised his role from the original Godzilla movie in the remake Godzilla 1985. <laughs> now, a while back, uh, I was given a stack of Michigan Bar Journals. It was the official publication of uh, 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 Michigan lawyers. And this stack was from the mid-1950s to the mid-1960s. And in it, in one that wasn't dated, that I believe was from the early 1960s, uh, there were two photographs of Mr. Bar uh, Burr, who was a special guest at the Pantlind Ballroom in Grand Rapids, Michigan, for a luncheon session. and. Um, the Pantland, if you've never seen it, and I've never seen it except in photographs, was elegant and, and, I mean, the perfect setting for a Perry Mason type character. Now, on one of the photographs, the caption uh, for the group image reads in part, the star or the state bar office staff swarms all over TV hero Raymond Burr, who is enjoying the adulation of his well-wishers and uh, to, to their fullest. Now, the ladies that are in the image with him are identified, and uh, they would be way, way, way up in years now if they were still alive. But if any are, or if they were your mom, aunt, grandma, whatever, um, and you have <clears throat> memories that you might be able to share on this event, I'd like to, I would like to invite you to leave them in the comments below. The ladies identified left to right are Fern Eddy, Mrs. Ronald Simon, Mrs. Ro Robert St Stephens, S-T-E-F-F-E-N-S, Mrs. Donald Webb, Mrs. Donald C. Rusa, and Miss Kathleen Watts. Now, there are only two images, but they're rare images, and I think they're an interesting little part of Michigan history and Michigan legal history that such an, uh, you know, an iconic figure was so well respected that he was brought into this, to this distinguished group of Michigan attorneys and, uh, was presented as their special guest. So I hope you enjoyed taking a look at these two images. I tossed in a few images of his other roles. And uh, thank you for stopping by and watching. Have a great day. God bless. Love you all. See you later.